hello hello again my t and Turbo family and thank you guys for tuning in to another episode this is going to be a general read so it may or may not resonate with you take what does leave what does and energy is fluid so feel free to flip the switch and put yourself where you fit up in it last but not least any pronoun that i use he she her him speaking of masculine or feminine energy unless otherwise stated guys okay we're gonna jump on into this we're gonna see how your person is feeling about you what's going on between you and your person in the relationship what you may need to know Okay, what you may not be seeing. Spirit can give us some information about the collective and their person. What's going on? This could be somebody you're in a commitment with. This could be somebody you just recently met, you're talking to, you're getting to know. This could be somebody that you're dating. Okay, guys. One last shuffle. Okay, Spirit. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Now we do need it to jump. Can you tell me what's going on for the collective and their person and their relationship right now? What do they need to know? What does the collective need to know right now? Okay. So first off right now, I do feel like you guys need to forgive, okay? Spirit says forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present moments. So I do feel like a lot of you guys may still be holding on to hurt from the past, people from the past. Things that just didn't go right, that, that left you a little scarred. It's time to forgive so you can move forward, okay? Spirit says to take the lessons, but leave leave the hurt, you know? The next thing says, Spirit says flirt, okay? This person that, you're, that you've been dealing with could have hurt you. And, and Spirit says if this is what you want, that you know, you have to forgive and move on. Um, they said extend your lighthearted energy to others. So flirt with your person. Or your person wants to flirt with you. But you need to bring that lighthearted energy back into the relationship, guys, okay? If this is something that you want, you really need to. You need to learn to forgive. You have to let go. Um, and the forgiving really is for you so you can heal. And 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 bring that playfulness back, okay? Spirit says, because there is an attraction here, okay? You are you you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. So Spirit is saying for you to attract your person back in or for you guys to fix whatever may not be right at the moment flirt um be romantic enjoy the moment enjoy getting to know each other enjoy rekindling the fire okay releasing whatever no longer serves you here whatever it is you need to forgive right because it's a lot of passion bring that passion back allow your heart and soul to sing with joy okay enjoy this relation whatever is people make mistakes all the time i don't feel like whatever this is is something super and big um, for some it may be, but for the majority of you, I don't really think it's like something like just so unforgivable that you can't, you know, forgive them. For those of you who, who, you know, you have dire situations because there are some that is unforgivable. This is not your situation here. This is a situation where somebody made a mistake. Okay. They made a mistake. This person still has a lot of love for you. You have a lot of love for this person, but you guys have to learn to forgive and move forward. Okay. Um, allow your passion and attraction. Flirt with this person. Enjoy this moment with this person. This is beautiful. For some of you guys, this person is not the one who did to you. This could be forgiving people from your past, okay? So that you can enjoy and flirt and have this new passionate connection with someone new. Here, Spirit. Okay, Spirit. So, uh oh It jumped. That was success. It flew out. It says, I know that there is no greater goal than to love so there is success here in this relationship guys it, it flew all the way out my hand and across the table so I, I need to pick it up there is success here you can have success but you have to remember relationships are something that's built at it's not never 100 perfect nobody's perfect so a relationship's not going to be perfect it's something you have to work at and people make mistakes you know you have to decide you know, was it something that was too too big to be forgiven and you need to move on and let go? Or if it's something that you guys can work through and get past. For most of you guys, I feel this is something you can work through and get past here. Very passionate. Okay, tell me more spirit about this relationship from my collective and their person. Yeah, adversity. So you guys have been through some type of challenges, okay? Whatever the challenge is, spirit says it's time to forgive, to move forward. It says, I accept the challenges are the best way to learn. So whatever challenges it was that you and your person went through, you had to go through that, guys, so that you could get the lesson. That's why I said forgiving and learning. So take the lesson and forgive your person. 
It, it could be dealing with your self worth. It could deal with abandonment issues. It could deal with control issues. But I do feel like there was a lesson there that you had to learn. Okay, it was a purpose. I can't make it up. It says, "I know what I am here to do." This person knows that they want to be with you. You know you want to be with this person. Okay, but the adversity that you guys went through, it was for a purpose. It was for a reason. This is my spirit says. Now you need to forgive this person and move forward. Get back to flirting, attraction, the passion. Okay, you had to go through that situation with this person so that you guys can elevate to the next level here. Your your thing that may have to be just learning to forgive, learning to let go. That may be what what your lesson is. It could have to do with self worth here. Okay, but there is abundance coming in here for you. Okay, spirit says you are a limited a limitless being and you can manifest whatever you desire into this physical reality and i feel like you've done that and you can do that here with this person as well there is abundance here within this relationship okay you guys can fix this and move forward and have abundance you need to learn to forgive and let go you can't hold on to it. once you say you're forgiving somebody you have to let go spirit says bring humor back into the situation Okay, extend the lighthearted energy to others. Bring the humor back. He says, I choose to focus on the lighter side of life. Spirit says, be patient. I accept that everything happens in divine order. Understand that everything that has happened between you and your person is being divinely timed and divinely guided here. And the last one that popped out was courage. It says, have the strength to move forward here. Have the strength to forgive this person and keep on pushing. Okay, because there is something that's very abundant here. There's something that's very uh, uh, passionate, a very attractive Flirting relationship. This is something that could build into something very, um, something long term here. Something, I don't know why he wants to say something to write about in, in a, a time of history. Like, I feel like this is like, I don't know, like, like, like that love story here that you always see on TV that you never think comes true. You know what I'm saying? Because it's TV. But I feel like it's that type of, that type of situation here with the, you and this person. Spirit says, have courage. I find the inner strength to face fear with confidence. Okay, find your confidence, trust in this person. Okay, trust that you're being guided to right, make the right decisions here. Okay, tell me more, spirit, about the collective in their person. Yep, you have a friendship here. Okay, spirit says continue to build this friendship between you and this person. I feel like this could be a soulmate connection, um, divinely guided, connected. Okay, connection here. It says, I understand that a friend is in my life for a reason. This connection is here for a reason. This person came into your life for a reason. They came in to teach you some lessons, but they also came in to bring you abundance and love. Spirit says, you have to get past your fears now, okay, and move forward, okay? Bring laughter and joy back into this, okay? Some understanding, flirt, bring, the, bring that, that life, liveliness back into this relationship, into this friendship. Okay, I do feel like this relationship is built on a friendship. Whatever it is that you've been denying, it's time for you to come out of that denial. Okay, you're, you're in fear. It says, I acknowledge my fear, but I replace it with the insight of awareness. So whatever it is you're fear, fearful of, if you're fearful of this person committing the same action again, if you're fearful of this person doing something to you that somebody in the past has done, you need to forgive and, and move forward. You need to let go of this fear. Okay, and if you've been lying to yourself saying that you're not afraid, you are. Stop denying it. It's time to release. It's time to face your truth, face your inner demons, so that you can move forward towards this relationship because there is success here. It came back out. Okay? It came back out. There is success here. There is. <laughs> Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. It says success. I know that there is no greater goal than to love. And this relationship is going to bring that. Tell me more, spirit. Yep. You're so worried about failure. That's why you're in fear. You're so worried that you're going to get hurt again. You're so worried that the, the past is going to repeat itself. You're finna fuck up and miss out on this success, guys. It says, I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. So I feel like your person also was saying, look, they feel like they made this mistake and, and they want to fix it, okay? They want success here with you. They're not in denial from what they did. They know they fucked up, okay? But they want to fix it too because they feel this connection and this attraction to you. Okay, they feel abundance here with you and they're getting their courage up because it's taking a lot for them to come back too because they feel like they were a failure because they feel like they failed you. Okay, and they never wanted to fail you, but they're human. They're human. You're a human. Remember that. Remember, you have made mistakes, collective, okay? And if the shoe was on the other foot and whatever happened you did to somebody else, 
How would you want your person to accept you? How would you want your person to come at you? You know what I'm saying? Remember that as you come at this person. Empathy is always the best way. Remember, okay? Anything else here, spirit? Have an empathetic heart. Okay. Huh. Look, judgment at the bottom. I told you, have an empathetic heart when you pass judgment on this person. Okay? Because remember, one day it may be you, and somebody may be passing judgment on you. Just be mindful, guys, okay? Be mindful. This person has a lot of love for you. You have a lot of love for this person. You can move forward. I don't feel like this person is going to do it again. Okay? You can let go of the fear. There is success here. You do not have to worry about this failure here. Let go of it. As long as you keep thinking failure and, and, and you're in denial of this fear, this is what you're going to call in. And you don't want that because this is something that's very successful. The judgment card says, I understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges. Okay? That's what they need you to understand. Understand that your person did what they had to do because that was part of their written journey, okay? Understand you handled it the way you handled it because it was part of your journey. You both had to learn something. Now you both need to forgive and move forward. You both need to forgive and move forward here because there is success here in this relationship, guys. Release the doubt. I can't make it up. Spirit says release the doubt. As long as you stay in doubt about this relationship, about this person, about moving forward here, that's what you're going to get, Okay? And, and I don't feel like that's what you want. This, this could be something that's very successful. This is I release the need to know all the answers. Stop trying to control everything. Stop trying to know how it turns out and how it ends. Okay? Enjoy the moment. You're so worried about the ending, you're going to fuck around and miss it. You're going to miss it, guys. And there is success here. Spirit says accept it. Accept that you still have some fear and some things from the past you haven't released so that you can release it. Stop being in denial because if not, you're going to call in failure when there's success here within this relationship between you and this person. It says, I am learning to accept the things that I cannot change. You can't change the past. This person can't change what they did, but they do want to fix it. And if it was you and you made the mistake and you were honestly trying to come in and fix something with somebody, for real, how would you want to be treated? Think about it. Spirit says, imagine it. Imagine it. Imagine how you would want to be treated. Since I embrace and nourish the creative aspects of my mind. Okay, I can't make this shit up. Look, balance came out in reverse, but on the empathy, you got to balance out that empathy. I'm open to seeing both sides of a situation. Balance, I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world, and I do so without, without judgment. Come on, speak to my spirit. Okay? Be mindful, collectively. <laughs> Be mindful. You're going to miss out on something, okay? They made a mistake. For some people, like I said, this is not for somebody who did something super wrong. This is somebody, it, it was something small, minor. This is something that you can get over. It was a lesson that needs to be learned, okay? And I feel like it was a lesson on both parts, guys. So if this resonates with you, if you want to know more about what's going on between you, your person, this person... Um, your spiritual journey, anything that you may need to know, my information is down below in the description box. If you're interested in ordering either the spiritual bath, the money bath, or um, the love bath, that's also down there. The rose oil, the rose water, all the braces are in as well. Um, I think that's everything right now. For those who have left me tips, donations who have booked with me, thank you, thank you, thank you, guys. It means so much to me. For those who have left comments, click the thumbs up and who have subscribed. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That means even more to me. And for those who want to do, who haven't done, just the fact that you want to, that means a lot to me as well. So thank you, guys. Until next time, you guys keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. And bye, my babies. Mwah!